Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be talking about the upcoming LooksRare token unlocks and my thoughts on the price action. So if you're new to the channel and you want to show some support, please leave a like and subscribe. So first I'm starting off here on the LooksRare docs to go over the strategic sale supply that we'll be unlocking in just a few weeks. If we go to this distribution table, we can see how about 3.3% of the total supply was allocated towards this strategic sale, which is around 33 million Lux tokens. So these tokens that were allocated in the strategic sale are going to be unlocking in around two weeks. So if we scroll all the way down here to the release schedule, we can see that the strategic sale tokens will be available for trading 180 days after launch. Some people are speculating that all the strategic investors are going to sell their tokens on the market as soon as they unlock, um, which would cause a pretty harsh sell-off. One thing I want to note though is that um, all the people who have invested in the strategic sale have already realized extremely large liquid profits. So if you don't know, Looks Rare allows you to stake your tokens for trading rewards. And basically everyone who got into the strategic sale has locked up their tokens um, for the 180 days and are able to stake those. So they had pretty large amounts of staking rewards that were in wrapped Ethereum and they could sell and trade that wrapped Ethereum. So they've already experienced pretty large profits. And I think at this point, given the looks rare um, token decline, I, I think that it's probably pretty minuscule for how much those tokens are worth. Again, it's only 33 million. And at the current looks rare price, um, that's, that's not as much as it used to be um, at its peak. So obviously there is speculation out there as to what this will cause the price action to do. But I think in general, a lot of these people who have invested in the strategic sale are most likely not planning on selling their tokens or at least I wouldn't think they would because I think you know most likely they have they have seen those rewards for staking and they're going to continue to stake it um, that's just my assumption so I'm going to switch over to the looks rare price on trading view to go over my thoughts and analysis on that all right so here is the token price here on trading view this blue line here represents when those tokens will be unlocked and I think most likely we are going to be seeing um, a little bit of anticipation for this unlock where uh, I think the market is probably going to sell off a little bit into into this time frame where where people are kind of anticipating a market dump from those strategic investors and then when they realize that they won't be dumping their tokens then we can start turning around and maybe reversing and I think you know if we do something like that maybe we come back down um, and, and kind of sell off into this anticipation for this event and maybe we start to round off here um, but then people realize, okay, we, we kind of overestimated this. Um, maybe it's not as bad. And then from there, we might start trending back up. And if we can form this new trend here where we have these higher lows, uh, something like this where we start to kind of put in a, a different trend here, counter to this longer term downtrend. If we're able to do something like this, that would be pretty bullish. And the market wouldn't have that overhanging anticipation of a bunch of tokens becoming unlocked because a lot of people are thinking, you know, well, what happens if 33 million tokens are sold on the market? I'm going to open up the volume now and, and just show you how, how much volume that would be um, kind of relative to the prior volume candles. So if we go down here, we can see that this volume candle here on this daily chart um, has done 1.39 million. And that's, that's for an entire day. So the fact that, you know, there could be a possibility where 33 million tokens are, are, are dumped on the market, um, obviously that would cause a massive spike in volume and that would all be negative volume kind of corresponding to a pretty large sell-off. So I think a lot of people are kind of nervous around that. So we will have to see whether or not they do sell their tokens, but I don't think they will. I think they're going to stake them and continue to earn those rewards. And, and you know, I think following this move here, um, it still is pretty insignificant as to what the prior token price was, right? So these strategic investors obviously are at pretty large profits. However, they're still down about 94% from the peak and it might be in their best interest since they've already covered their initial investment, re realized they're a pretty sizable profit. It might be in their best interest to just hold this for the longer term. So that's kind of my thoughts on what they're going to do. Again, we're not sure. We have to wait and see. This is all speculation. But if I had to make a reasonable estimate, I would say that most likely the market's going to overprice some sort of sell-off into this unlock phase and then turn around and realize, okay, maybe it's not going to be as bad as we thought and, and form some sort of higher low 
kind of corresponding to this new trend where we have some sort of uptrend counter to this longer term downtrend. So that's kind of my analysis. I hope you guys did enjoy. And as always, I will see you in the next one.